Good morning. Happy Monday. I hope everyone is having a great Monday so far. Uh, March is coming to an end and the first quarter is about to be over for 2018. The second quarter is about to start it. So if you have a game plan, you should be finishing up 25% of the 100% that you set up for your business already. If you don't have a game plan, you can contact me at 281-782-5615 and I would love to sit down and help you to set up a game plan for this year for your business. I have my motivation from this book that I just read this month called Rhinoceros Success, The Secret to Charging Full Speed Towards Every Opportunity from Scott Alexander. And I'll, I'll mention three main key point that I get from the first chapter to you guys and kind of give you some example that way you can have an idea of what they're talking about. Number one is charge with singleness of purpose. For me is that you know whenever I set up my business I want to be able to help international orphanages so that's my purpose. Every deal that I do I set out part of my commission to help with the orphanage. So uh, with that purpose in mind, you know, I can tell people whenever I talk to people about real estate and this is what I do. The second key point is be alert for opportunities. What does that mean? Be alert for opportunity. For me is that whenever I'm out about at a lunch appointment and things like that and I hear somebody you know, talk about real estate, or oh, I'm looking to buy a house soon, or I'm thinking about selling my house. I make myself to come and introduce myself to them and, you know, hand them a business card and let them know that I'm a real estate agent and I can assist them. You know, at first it was very awkward for me to do that, but when I had my purpose in place, I can, you know, talk to people without being very, you know, nervous about it because now, Every deal that I make, more often gonna be able to eat. So for me, I always be on the lookout for opportunities. The third key point is charge down opportunities. What does that mean? For me is that if a person recommend a lady to sell a house to me, I don't wait for the lady to contact me. I reach out to the lady, set up an appointment to meet with her at her house, and see what I can do to help her to sell her house. Same thing if somebody recommend a guy to buy a house, I'm not gonna wait around for him to call me, but I'm gonna take the initiative and give him a call and ask him proper question. How many bedrooms are you looking for? What area are you looking for? Have you get qualified with a loan officer yet? You know, those are the questions that I'd be more intentional to charge down the opportunity. Um, so those are the opportunity that, you know, I get to do and be a part of. Here are a few tips that I feel is, is going to help you to maybe convert some more leads into your business. Uh, the first one is to contact the seller who you have an appointment with but still haven't got that listing. Um, I would chase out those leads that you already have and, you know, get in contact with them and ask them, Hey, I know that, you know, we met last month. How come, you know, you still haven't listed your house? Um, maybe, you know, they're waiting for you to make that final contact so they can list their house. Or, you know, contact the previous buyer that didn't close the deal with you and ask them, Hey, I know that, you know, we have a deal that fell through. Um, did you be able to get everything lined up so we can try to restart this process again? And hopefully they're going to say yes and, you know, you can help them again to look for the house. Um, other than the book, you know, I always get up every morning and looking at some motivational um, video from YouTube and, you know, places like that. Uh, here are the two people that I'm actually following right now. The first one is Eric Thomas and the second one is Jay Shetty. These are the two people that I find a lot of. Um, energy that I can use in every day that I do business with and uh, if you have any um, other motivational speaker that you like to recommend you can comment below and I would love to check them out um, hope you have a good Monday 
if you need any help, you are welcome to reach out to me via email, via text. I'm here to help. Again, my phone number is 281-782-5615. Have a good day.